men, one a former Keolis worker, are charged with cheating the commuter rail operator out of millions that was designed to keep the trains moving. WBZ's Paula Evan is here now with more on how this scheme worked. Paula. Attorney Rachel Rollins announced 17 charges against former Keolis Rail Chief Engineer John Pigsley for an alleged fraud conspiracy that siphoned $8 million from the commuter rail. Pigsley was arrested this morning and just made his first appearance in court. Prosecutors say between 2014 and 2021, Pigsley worked together with the second man, a New Hampshire resident named John Rafferty, who's the general manager of an electrical contractor. Prosecutors say Say the two men worked together to steal the money by submitting false invoices to Keolis. In a statement, Keolis says in late 2021, our enhanced financial controls and project management oversight identified project anomalies linked with the practices of an employee. We took immediate action to investigate and ultimately suspended and then terminated the employee. Now, Rafferty, an electrical contractor, has already pleaded guilty. Pigsley was released after. After the hearing. Lisa? Paula, thank you.